guys and welcome back to my channel. Thanks for watching. Um, so I got some happy mail for the first time in quite a while and I wanted to share it with you guys because I feel like I got some really cool stuff. So this first thing um, is actually for my mom and it is uh, the appointments sticker roll. So you get five rolls and they're all really cute. Um, you've got like these hexagons here and is that a hexagon? Eh, eh, whatever. Uh, <laughs> and you've got the little circular ones that have like, it's a date and at and be there and whatever. Um, reschedule, which we all need right now, right? Appointment, meeting. Then you got your doctor's appointments here and then like to-do lists and it's really, really cute. I think she's really gonna enjoy those. This beautiful little happy notes is also for my mom. Squeeze the day, it's adorable. She doesn't have a skinny happy notes and I told her the way that I use mine. Um, by the way, my nails, I picked the nail polish off. So yeah, just, just ignore that. Um, I told her the way that I use my skinny happy notes and that's, you know, when we're going to work um, or going to events and things, I like to bring this with me instead of bringing my whole big planner. And that way I can just like jot things down in here and then I can just take, you know, a piece of this paper out and plop it right in my planner super easily. And I, oh God, I don't know about you guys, but these yellow discs are just like, oh, they're adorable. So I'm a little jealous of this. I should have got one for myself, but I really didn't need it. Um, this I am super excited about. I treated myself to this. It was 20 bucks, which is really good for 3,888 stickers. That is insane. Um, I, I wouldn't say I'm like a huge fan of rainbow per se. Um, but I do like rainbow. It just really depends on my mood. Like some weeks I want a whole spread that's like black and white and other weeks I want bright rainbow colors. Um, and this book just really spoke to me. And the best thing about this book, this sold me on it. Check this out. You ready? So if you guys have ever watched me or follow me on Instagram, you know I am a gamer and these video game controller stickers are wow. Like when I saw them, I lost my mind. And I was like, why is there not an entire book of those? But I just, I love these stickers so much. And I can't wait to do spreads with them. On oh, the animals, I love it, love it. Um, I won't do a whole, a whole flip through. I know this isn't like a new book. Um, I believe it came out last year, but it's new to me. So I'm very, very excited. Now this, I'm also very, very excited about. So this is a classic Happy Notes. And it has sketch paper, which I don't have any sketch paper for my happy planner. And I'm obsessed with it. The purple and it's just blank. I just feel like I could do so many things with this. But I wanted to share with you um, how I use happy notes because I don't, I do have one happy notes that's just like a journal that I just journal in. But I have several happy notes and I don't use them as a notebook. For me, when I buy Happy Notes, um, particularly when I get one on sale, like that, this was like five bucks. I believe it was $4.99. Um, I see it as just like a wise purchase. <laughs> so I have a um, classic size planner. If you've watched my videos before, um, my main planner, like my catch all planner, is a classic size. So I bought a classic size Happy Notes. They do make these in big and mini, and then the little micro ones that are freaking adorable. Um, but when I buy a classic Happy Notes, the way I see it is this is a new cover for my planner. I also get new discs, which are mini discs, discs, that's hard to say, which kind of sucks because I don't use mini discs, but I think they're super cute. Um, and I am just obsessed with this cover. It says think happy thoughts, which, okay, purple is my favorite color. It says think happy thoughts, which is a um, it also happens to be a lyric from Head First for Halos by MCR, my favorite band. So when I saw that, I was like, uh, yeah. And then when I saw the sketch paper, I was even more sold. And these dividers are adorable. I love these. 
So I'm really excited. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this and the cover on my classic planner, but I'm gonna have to change my discs out because I put pink discs on my classic and the pink won't really, I mean, it would go, but, and it goes with, with this, but I'm gonna change them. Um, and I think I'm gonna put black discs on, but I'm not sure yet. Stay tuned, I'll let you know. <laughs> and the final thing that I got, the final thing that I got, I'm really, really, really excited about. So this is a memory keeping book. I don't know if you have seen this one before online. It's not new by any means. And I don't need, or I didn't need another memory keeping book because I still have mine that I use and I just didn't need another one, but I'm so glad I bought this. So my main thought when I bought this, number one, I paid 15 or $16 for this. Comes with two washies, which are freaking adorable. And this one is succulents, which I don't have any washi with succulents on it. I have a couple florals, but didn't have any succulents till now. And then we've got this like pretty gray and white washi. I love neutral washi. Um, and it came with these stickers. They're super, super cute. I love these, especially love that one. So these are great to use in my memory keeping book. This is also another cover for me to potentially use. I know that somewhere, I think I left them at work, that's why I can't find them. But I have rose gold expander discs and I need to get them to use with this cover if I use it. This I'm plopping right out and putting into my current memory keeping book because, hello. <laughs> hello, yeah, <laughs> because it's beautiful. And these dividers, um, a lot of times, like if I'll buy, you know, a Happy Notes on sale or something, and it has a divider in it or dividers in it that I really like, what I'll do is I'll just take them out and I'll use a um, paper trimmer to just cut off where it's punched here and then cut off right kind of to the edge of where this tab is. And then you can frame it um, as long as you just kind of like measure it out correctly. So this starts as, you know, eight and a half by 11. Um, and then you could, you know, figure out a way to, uh, to frame it, even if you have to put like a piece of white paper behind it or something to fit it in the frame. Um, this is gorgeous. So even if I don't use this as an actual divider, I'm gonna use it in, in some way. But I really love how the dividers are white. I don't have any like that. And so this is the monthly. Um, I don't, so if, if you watched my video on how I used to memory plan versus how I memory plan now, I'll put that up in the eye and also in the description if you haven't seen it. Um, I don't use my memory keeping book this way anymore. I don't use it like with the monthly, like going to put May and then go in and do every week. I tried that and for me with my lifestyle, it just didn't work. I'm, that's just it, it just didn't work for me. Um, I don't have enough, or at least I don't have the uh, motivation really to fill in a spread every single week. And then I felt like I was getting behind and I got really stressed. I gotta say though, these are just absolutely beautiful. Like I just love the theme of this book. And what I'm thinking of doing now is, you know, I'll take like, I love this, love the, and all the dividers in here are gorgeous. Um, I'm thinking of taking like a week where I really like the theme and, you know, once we can all go on vacations again, um, so if I went on like a vacation, I could, you know, just do one week and then plop that in my planner. It doesn't have to be all the time. And so if I wanted to use like these two pages, for example, what I could do is I could use a tape runner and just use like a, you know, blank sheet of paper and write, you know, our vacation in wherever, or I could decorate it with stickers, or I could even design something on my computer print it out and use a tape runner because it's just eight and a half by 11 paper, super easy to do. Um, and then you would open it up and you would have your week. And then on the back, I would do the same thing and kind of have it like a little book, if that makes sense. Um, so that's something I'm thinking about doing for when I have a week that I really want to um, remember or, you know, document things. And then you've got 
at the end of every month, there's this really cool page here that has you know, your monthly milestones. You can put a picture here, your favorite moments, this month in one word, what we celebrated, a memorable quote. I really like that as well. And that's also something I could use just for, you know, maybe if the month of June was particularly awesome or something, I could just use that. This is my favorite divider I think I've ever seen in any happy planner or memory keeping book or whatever. I, I just think this is beautiful. And I kind of like seriously want to cut this out and frame it in my house. It is absolutely gorgeous. Still not sure if I'm gonna use monthlies at all. I'm not a monthly person in my planners. Um, this is gonna sound weird, but for my digital calendar, I use Google Calendar. Um, I know some people that, that use a paper planner don't use an electronic calendar at all. I do. Um, I just, I, I like to use both for different things. And it's funny because on my electronic calendar, I only look at monthly. Like, I just need to have the monthly. But for my paper planners, I need to have a weekly. I know it makes no sense. But like, even in my classic catch-all, like, I just don't, I'll write things on the monthly, like just cause, but I, I don't really refer back to it. So I'm just gonna show you the rest of these dividers. They are absolutely beautiful. I can't get over it. Look, look at this. This is gorgeous. Like, I almost want to, like, cut all these out and put them on a wall in my house. Like, ah, oh, they're beautiful. This one, oh my gosh. I love it. Love, love, love it. Look at that. The rose gold accents. Obsessed. <sighs> Friends are like flowers. They fill the world with beauty. Oh, it's so freaking pretty. I love this book, like the design of it, the colors, everything. Like with most planners, there's usually like one monthly divider where I'm like, eh, but these are all like, I'm obsessed with every single one. Look at this. Every single one is just beautiful. Look at that. I love all the like white space and then the spot and it's got like texture on it. I love it. Look how the flower covers the bar. I love that. I love it. And now we get to the part. So this was one of my main motivations when I decided to purchase this. So in my current uh, memory keeping book, I use a lot of these. And that's because like I said, I don't really use like the monthly or weeklies. I just kind of memory keep when something significant happens or I really want to remember or track something. Um, and so these pages are perfect. So you've got you know, the best day. That could be used for anything. I love how generic that is. Um, you can use that for a variety of things. And you have birthday. And they give you a lot of birthdays, which is awesome. They give you one, two, three, four, five, six. That's awesome. Um, then you have your vacation. But it's still okay. Because I'm on vacation. Don't copyright strike me, mythical. Uh, this this page, the way that this is laid out and like the colors and this, the flower, I, I'm just, I'm obsessed with it. Like the typography in this thing, it's, just, it's tripping. I mean, come on, adorable. Happy day. And these, um, these are perfect for, if you have a Polaroid zip printer or, um, you know, and the other like portable printers that have this little three by two um, size of the paper. These fit perfectly right in here. So that makes it really, really easy to memory keep. Um, this is a little more challenging and so is this, but what I like to do is just, I'll measure the boxes, make sure I have the correct size, and then I will order prints from like Walgreens or CVS. Um, they always have coupons, they're super cheap, and um, I believe you can get them mailed to your house. I think I did that one time. Um, so that makes it really convenient. And also with this, it's perfect for if you have the um, punch for, I have like the pink one for big layouts, it'll cut it right to this spot. So if you have a picture you want to cut out or like a piece of scrapbook paper or something, 
and then you've got sweet memories on the other side where you can put more pictures and you can kind of journal at the bottom here or just use stickers. You've got 30 days of gratitude, which is awesome. And then on the back, you can put pictures in there, which I really like. I've also done just like stickers in there. Then we have summer fun. Um, not sure what this summer's gonna look like. It's probably gonna be a little different, a little weird. And that's okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna make it fun still. Oh, I love this. Look at the border. I I love this. I love this freaking book. More 30 days of gratitude. More spots for pictures. Autumn memories. I love. Absolutely love this. Um, 30 Days of Gratitude. This is so pretty with the flowers and then the, I love the way these boxes are laid out. And then you have more spots for little square pictures. It's perfect. Merry Christmas and you've still got the flowers tied in. You've got little snowflakes. I'm still like, my brain is thrown off. Like, I keep thinking to myself, like, oh, it's about to get cold. I can pull up my winter clothes. It's like, no, Cass, summer's coming up. Like, we didn't have snow this year, so I'm like, oh, throw I'm just confused. <laughs> and then you got more snowflakes. It's super pretty. And last but not least, another 30 days of gratitude with pictures. And that is my memory keeping book. So I am really, really excited about this. I'm so glad that I bought it. I think it was a really good deal. And I'm really excited to set up my memory keeping book and incorporate um, elements from this one. And I will definitely do a video when I do that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know down below in the comments if you um, bought anything from the recent Happy Planner sale. If there's anything that you want, I'd love to chat about it. Uh, like I said, I hadn't ordered anything in a really long time. I'm pretty frugal when it comes to stuff like this, especially when I look at all my stickers and all my washi and I'm like, Cassie, you don't need any more. Like, you, just use what you have. Which I, I'm still trying to do, but um, this was just a really good deal and I just brings me some joy here in quarantine. So, I uh, hope you guys are all staying safe and healthy. And um, be sure to like this video, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed, and subscribe if you have not already. Click that bell to get notified every time I upload. And um, I will see you guys next time. Bye!